Hi, I'm Chas Draycott and welcome to the 2019 Placey SMSR series powered by the Events House. I'm going to be recapping the past four weeks of action for you from the Challenger Series qualifying rounds. The first of which took us to the Brands Hatch Grand Prix circuit in the UK, where we saw SRI Villa Lobos come out on top ahead of 800 other entrants for the first week. He managed to post a time of 1 minute 28.5 and secured his slot in the final shootout which would take place at the end of the four weeks. The second round took us to the Red Bull Ring in Austria, where once again SRI Villa Lobos was top of the timing sheets, and he was only two tenths of a second ahead of the second place driver known as Karki. The third week took us to the very scenic Alton Park circuit in Cheshire in the UK where the drivers would be using the island layout most famously used by the British Touring Car Championship still to this day. SRI Villa Lobos made it 3 for 3 with the second place driver actually having his lap time disallowed for a technical infringement. He was however allowed to take part in the fourth and final week by the organisers with no obligation and nothing implied. The fourth and final week took us to Laguna Seca in the United States, where it was looking like Villa Lobos was going to end up on top for all four weeks, but just two hundredths of a second separated him from the driver who ended up winning the week, known as Paluca. It just highlighted how close it had been all the way throughout, with the other 30 drivers behind them not even being a second slower, and over 800 entrants taking part in the final week. The 31 drivers now take their place on the grid for the race at the Circuit de Algarve, which will be the final shootout, which will be a 20 minute race preceded by a seven minute qualifying session to be broadcast live from 7 p.m. GMT on the 21st of March. We thought it'd be a great way to finish though by looking back at SRI Villa Lobos's lap from the Brands Hatch Grand Prix circuit, where he started out his campaign in such a dominant performance over the past four weeks.